Model UN, I, I really do think, gave me the base for what I do now. And it starts when you're writing your position paper. You're not going to be the smartest one in the room at your Model UN competitions, but you have the ability to be the most prepared. I joined my second year of high school, uh, Model UN. And I think that the friendships that I made and the experiences that I had ultimately led me to where I am today. Model UN is so important to bringing diplomacy, like soft skills to people who might not, you know, get that opportunity to practice otherwise. Um, it's a wonderful way to keep young people involved in current events. Uh, just because most of the, you know, scenarios that you're involved with are based off of current events or something that could potentially happen. Coming into Model UN, I probably had nearly no negotiation skills for sure, but um, going through, uh, I was able to learn a lot more about how to properly and effectively um, speak publicly, express my thoughts to, um, succinctly, and kind of just come away with a meaningful interaction with other people over my years. I think that Model UN definitely helped me like get my thoughts across um, a lot more quickly. And really, I, I do want to stress like without like the Naples Council on World Affairs, like I would not be, you know, where I am today. So I owe a lot of, of the places that I've been and the things that I am so privileged to be able to do to the Naples Council on World Affairs. One memorable challenge is the fact that you're working with information about different countries that you may not be, you know, always in the know of. So you're constantly having to do a lot of background information, which, I mean, it hones in your critical thinking skills. The cultural um, experience that Model UN gives you and, and can provide to you with interacting with people from wildly different backgrounds is something that I, especially in that conference, to what I am doing now, have seen a lot of growth and was a, a directly transferable situation. And being inclusive of delegates from different backgrounds than your own, who are also in the same situation of representing belief systems that may or may not be their own, is a huge part of Model UN that is a major transferable skill because every company now has some sort of element of diversity, equity, and inclusion in their workspace. I think that learning to listen is a huge aspect of communication that I learned with Model UN. I think now more than ever, it is crucial that students participate in something like Model UN. Um, I can see our country getting more and more divided and more and more intolerant of other ideas. Um, and I can only imagine how much better our country and the world would be if everyone had done Model UN. <laughs>